uh, actually, I wanted to continue in the same vein and, and uh, uh, talk about a um, movement in Indonesia, uh, just to take us away a little bit from Europe and the US context. Uh, and uh, there I'm studying a movement of uh, 1.5 million farmers who have decided to uh, do farming and food production in a not only sustainable way, but in a socially responsible way. So they're not out to produce uh, organic food for elites, but they're really out to produce affordable, healthy food for their communities. And they're having a huge impact because there's just so many of them. Uh, and I, I see, you know, what, what they do in the, on the ground, and it really gives me some hope because they're changing the way uh, the whole ecosystems work they're reversing some of the damages. And uh, this is major change, major change uh, at, at a local level, but it sums up. And the, the interesting thing is that um, they um, have a, an understanding of, of moral economy. So it's really about transforming the way people uh, think about farming as an economic activity and they want to take some of that whole market ideology out and bring back a community um, uh, uh, way of thinking that's based on mutual support. So it's, it's quite, quite a, a radical shift and there's so much of this happening. These same farmers uh, are also uh, visiting other countries with the help of La Via Campesina, they have farmer exchanges. So they've just been to, uh, to Vietnam and have helped uh, farmers there double their, their productivity and at the same time go organic. So, uh, and now, you know, it's, it's, it's also really spreading in Vietnam and in, in other places in Southeast Asia that I know about, also in India, in Sikkim, for example. Um, Sikkim has just been awarded a World Future Council a gold award for their sustainability measures. The, the, in, the entire uh, state has become organic. This is massive, you know, I mean, we talk about climate change, but agriculture contributes about a third of uh, to, to emissions. So it's really, really significant. And I just wanted to say that this kinds of local actions uh, often go unnoticed. We think about institutions, big organizations and their, their efforts, but we don't see these kinds of uh, uh, 